Last lecture, we completed the source code development work. In this lecture, we will base on the Mokito to write the unit test source code to verify our login module is correct in this. OK, here we go. First, we need to introduce the dependency into our POM file. As you can see, we introduced the Mokito JUnit Jupyter and JUnit Jupyter Engine. Of course, we need some assertion library is Hemcrest. OK, now let's create the source code. Open the controller and out and the, the create test. All right. It's cool. Now, because our log in method will dependency the HTTP servlet request and uh, our user account service dependency is the account DAO and the account DAO dependency the database. So we need to mock the account data, the account DAO and the HTTP servlet request. Okay, define HTTP servlet request at here, request. And then we will define the account DAO, account DAO. We will use the mock annotation to do that, to mock the mock object. As you can see, come from Mokito library, right? So far, so maybe you don't understand the API usage, but don't worry. The next section, I will tutorial every details by example. Of course, code is the environment setup and, uh, and the Mokito version or uh, JUnit version uh, explanation. Okay. It's just we define the setup method. Annotated by before each, right? Now we should to define the login service and the login controller as a account service. Login controller. We will initial the login service and the login controller and the setup lifecycle method provided by JUnit 5 Jupyter API. Okay. This account service, new account service, and uh, sorry. We need to pass the account DAO. Okay, that's fine. And this login controller, new login controller, pass account service. And the most important is we don't forget to access with and uh, Mokito extension, but provided by Mokito. We annotate by um, Mokito extension will allow we use uh, Mok annotation at here. OK. First, we will write the simple test method used to verify we can log in the web application successfully. What test uh, log in success annotated by test? 
it's better to annotate the bar display. Um, user account is valid. Right. Now we need to um, we need to add some stabling statement with request get parameter user name then return admin okay and uh, export by static way other way request get parameter password then return one two three four five six this is a password right as you can see we get the user login profile from parameter at the source code okay all right now we need to define and create a user account object new user account okay account right we already completed the stubbling statement for http thread request now we need to stubbling the account DEO because so far this moment the database is unavailable right it's not available so we if we uh, evoke the fund user account method will be zero exception directly okay when user DEO account DEO find user account admin and one two three five four five six then return the user account now we can evoke the log con login controller HTTP request, right? And it will return the string. That is the result. From our source code and the stabling uh, statement declare, we expected the result will be equal to man, right? All right, let's do some assertion at here. Assert that we use the hamcrest result and the a is equal to man okay and port oh sorry is port i import the assertion statement from hamcrest as you can see by static way Okay, we completed the sec login successful unit test development work. Now we need to execute this unit test. From the output and the execution result, we found the login controller login method return result is matched our expected okay next lecture we will keep to complete the another um, remaining scenario about login function okay see you next lecture